that you're going to do something a little bit more complex. <laughs> or you shift to one side, cool, shift to another side. Um, starting with the same two, he throws, he throws the, the tee, I throw the tee, and catches the kick. Now, I'm going to throw the cross. So, what are hips we're doing? Hips go back. I'm sorry, weight goes back. We throw, weight goes to the right hand. No, to the right hand again. To the right hip. Shift our weight to the left. Now, on this retraction, we have to set our weight back on this side so we can push off. We have to change range, and we have to shift our weight to throw the punch. So you have to do three semi-complex hip motions on one beat. So doing that, kick, kick, plant, throw the punch. Here's what I'm thinking about doing is just like on the kick, where do we put this foot to throw to throw this kick? It's gotta be the end outside. So now I have to figure out where do I put my my foot to get a good base to push off to throw this punch to close range, from kicking range to hitting range, and where does this foot come off that range change to throw the cross on one beat. So you can, as you're going, you could break this down. If you're going with like, kick, kick, reset, take yourself, push in, and throw. You can do all that, probably get punched in the face while that's happening, it's possible. But maybe you have time to do that. And maybe it's worth doing that while you're breaking into three separate beats while you're practicing. But what you want to work up to is one, hit, and do all three motions. Weight shift here, plant foot weight shift, change or close range, shift away for the cross. All three beats on one shot. That's a lot you have to do with your hips. Um, and that's good. I'm going to teach you the grades. So, long range, medium long range, we're coming in, one more, any questions on that? That's a little more complex, so there will hopefully be a question too. No? I, I have a question on yes. the piece of it, yes. I have trouble kind of pivoting on the front, but I'm like I'm too planned, you know, like my hip isn't so so way, A good way to work on that is to work, um, you're going to pivot in the opposite direction, but you work just your, your base pivot, right? So if we're moving around, if that's here, and I'm working, I want to get to the side, if I stop from something else, I'm going to pivot and turn, right? Good, pivot with me. So work on that, okay. right? And to do that, you have to bring your weight onto this foot so you can spin, right? So do that a few times. Yeah. So that's this motion that we've been working is how you get to that, right? If you're 50-50, if you're 50-50 and planted, that's really hard to do, right? Okay. But if you bring that over and then we throw the kick, it's the same setup. Bring that weight up and instead of coming this way, right? Okay. And come around the other way. Okay. All right. Thank you. All right.